What it do, flight crew? FTC. Flight team stand up. It's you. We got the first official Madden 25 trailer. Now, I feel like EA, especially with Madden, bro, they're going to be working overtime because, like, this uh, college football game that's about to be dropping. Um, now, to be honest, I probably might have, because I don't see any other of the, the Madden people that I know that be going to, like, the community days and stuff or sponsored by EA with the videos of their perspective out now. Uh, so we'll probably have, like, two Madden, um, you know what I'm saying, episodes or um, uh, uh, breakdowns today. We have the first one with the trailer right here. And then anybody that, you know, happened to go to EA Sports or they're sponsored by them, like Eric Wayweather, Board Ox, and anybody else, just let me know whenever they post their breakdown videos because you guys know that they have more exclusive info outside the trailer and stuff like that. Just let me know. We'll just uh, we'll go ahead and react to it. But I don't see the videos right now. With that being said, bro, we're here to give our constructive criticism. Madden has been the same for the last four to five years, if we're being fair. The only reason why I still play the game is because of the ultimate team mode. So hopefully, they have a lot more to offer than just that. Let's check it out. If there's any music, I'll just mutt the whole video. Just doesn't sound like it. They brought that old tile pack, uh, type of play back in there. Finally! Finally! Bro, okay, I don't know if you guys remember this. It's crazy because I don't know if this was on Madden in the past. I know for a fact it was on the NCAA football games in the past that I have played. Bro, it is about time they add a damn reversal, bro, in the kickoff. I don't know why they took it out the game in the first place. I want to be sure that they had this in the Madden in the past. I just don't remember which Madden. Usually if you had a kickoff and you had the last opportunity to return the ball, you only was able to just like lateral it back. This is actually a big step in the right direction. I don't know why it took for college football to be returning for them to put this back in a playbook. Oh, and also the slamming. By the way, the last Eric Mayweather video we reacted to, I did. Uh, I was on and off questioning if that was Madden 25 gameplay. I was wrong, and I said that in the end of the video somewhere into it. But the Madden 25 scoreboard is going to be on the bottom this year, so that's how you're going to be able to tell the difference. So just want to throw that out there. Powered by Boom Tech. Authentic one on one impacts fueled by physics. But Field Sense isn't just Boom Tech. It's spectacular. Mm, I ain't gonna lie. And they just said it right there. They got new catch animations and everything. That catch, I'm not going to lie to you, was probably one of the more fire Madden catches. They should have been putting a lot more one uh, 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 one-handed uh, catches in the game. I ain't going to lie. Hey, nigga do this shit on me, bro. When I need to get a stop, this is an automatic controller break right here. <laughs> nigga caught this with four fingers, bro. This just, I, I mean, I lived off of catches like this back in the day in middle school for a fact. But, bro, doing this in a video game is a whole different type of ball game. Spectacular new grass. And more control across the field. So you I mean, let's be honest, that juke has already been a Madden before. And also, one thing I want you guys to understand from uh, 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 an ex EA partner uh, back in 2015, EA Sports is really good with editing and marketing and making nice commercial looking games of the football. So, this is actually not the exact gameplay. We're going to have to wait to see the gameplay to give our full. You know what I'm saying? Breakdown of everything. But I do see a couple of things that I do like already. First, it's that re uh, that receiver reverse thing. That's fire. It's about time they finally put that back in the game on a kickoff and stuff like that. Hopefully, it's not something where it's too cheese and too exploitive where it's just like you just don't have to kick it out of bounds or onside kick it all the time because it's just too toxic. And I do like the uh, they're saying that there's new catch animations. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's a good start. Now, as far as they're saying these on-field senses or whatever they're saying, i just seen the same juice that they've been having in Madden. But, hey, they have been mentioning, because Eric Wayweather dude mentioned in the last video we reacted to about the breakdown, that they have a lot more um, 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 different running animations. That's going to be a big step in the right direction. I do like that. Um, so, we're going to have to, like I said, we're going to have to see gameplay. Actually, game combo trailer, killer but. new hezzies with wicked more control across the field so you can combo killer new hezzies. I remember I broke the shit out of somebody back in the day with this move on the football on the football field, bro. That was nice. I like that animation right there. With wicked new juke and elusive new ball carrier mechanics. Okay, I give it on. Let me go. Let me go. It's time. 
time to buckle your chin straps and lower your shoulders. So you can dominate in franchise mode with the top. Yeah, they ain't, they, they ain't play with the graphics now. I mean, should we really be surprised? It's next gen systems. Um, and also another thing too, we have to also consider. Um, is this the max out of graphics that they're actually able to do? Because if you think about it, Madden Twenty One dropped with the PS Four, or the PS Five, excuse me. Um, you know what I'm saying almost what four years ago. When do they usually make a new system? Like every six years, seven years ish. So we're probably seeing the peak of graphics when it comes to these sports games, I feel like. So for the most part, the graphics was never a problem. It's the gameplay. Everybody knows that. Uh, but it's going to be interesting if you're going to be able to even top these graphics for even like Madden 26 for the following year. Dominate in franchise mode. with the You know what I'm saying? Like, look at that right there. Hold on. Shoulders. So you can dominate in franchise mode. I ain't gonna lie, the graphics look kind of, you know what I'm saying? They got authentic rookie head scans. Not that, you know, probably people are not gonna care. But, you know, let's be honest. Usually when the rookies come into the game, the first two years in Madden, especially or any video game for any sports, they kind of BS their face scan. This looks exactly like the Jaden McDaniels. Is this Jaden McDaniels or the uh, the Penix dude from the TCU Washington? Can't remember. With the top new rookies and fresh playbooks. Because nothing. It's like magic. Bro, CMC I know is going to be overpowered. Bro broke four tackles in the hurdle somebody for the touchdown. All right. Now, I'll be honest with you. Compared to college NCAA, this game is not worth pre-ordering right now. They need to show us a lot more stuff. <laughs> EA, y'all not going to get away with another one this year. From what everybody is talking about, everybody is focused on college football. So, do you guys got to show a lot more stuff, show a lot more, you know what I'm saying, things to get people a little bit more fired up? Because if I'm personally me, I'm not, I mean, you guys know I'm going to have to pre-order the game anyway to get it early so we can be on the stream and everything for it. But if you're just like the casual gamer that doesn't YouTube or stream, don't pre-order anything about Madden 25 just yet. They haven't showed anything. I mean, they've had a couple of cool things in this trailer, like I said, such as the you know the new kickoff reverse, maybe a couple more juke animations. They have new catching animations, new playbooks maybe, but we haven't seen the gameplay. You know what I'm saying? Because I honestly, to, 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 to be real, my humbly honest opinion about this, I really feel like it's basically Madden 25 is literally a copy and paste from College Football 25, which... And realisticallyness, if College Football 25 ends up, and I have high hopes for it, is going to end up being a good game or not. You know, if it's a good game, even if it's a copy and paste from College Football 25 to Madden 25, that's not really a bad thing. Now, the thing that's going to separate Madden, I feel like, from College Football is the game modes. We need to hear about more of the 7-on-7, seven seven, or is it the 3-on-3? Three three? Is it 3-on-3, three 5-on-5, three, five five or 7? That, that little backyard football mode, you know what I'm talking about. That literally lasts only for the first two weeks of Madden, and then nobody plays that mode anymore. They have so much opportunity to literally, like, go so far with that mode. Like, I really feel like y'all can pass up the 2K park with that mode. All right? Now, that doesn't mean you guys make a city mode. Don't start making golf carts and low riders and jetpacks. I'm not saying to do all that shit. But I feel like you guys can definitely get a lot more in-depth into that mode and a lot more, you know what I'm saying, just just detailed. And so that's just my personal, you know what I'm saying, opinion with that. And not even that, maybe like even the ultimate team mode. You guys need to have a lot more deep dives into the ultimate team mode. You need to give us a, a, a reason to play the mode, you know. Like let's say if you win the Super Bowl, you should be getting like at least a million coins. You give us about, what, 20,000 coins or something like that. There's really like no reason to play the game. Um, but you know, none of the fact the less you guys know we're gonna still cop this game. Um, and what is your guys' opinion? Does it make you want to pre-order the game? What is your thoughts about this game? Do you need to see more gameplay? Do you think college football 25, no matter what, is still gonna be the better game? And is Madden gonna plummet? Um, like I said, guys, GTA 6 drops next year. So I feel like with all these game companies, especially in the sports world, they're gonna be trying their hardest, I feel like. We would hope. So I'm going to keep my fingers crossed, and maybe this might be actually the best Madden that may have been dropped in the last 5 to 10 years just off of the muscle of GTA 6 about the drop. So, hey, man, who knows? Um, y'all let me know how y'all feel. My impression about Madden 25 so far, if, if, if I'll give it a rating so far. I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10 just for what they've displayed. 
I need to see the gameplay for that rating to change. For right now, it's, it is where I'm at. If, if you're going to sit up here and say that this is enough for you to cop the game and pre-order, like, let's go right in the PlayStation or Xbox store. We got, like, you, you know what I'm saying? You're getting you're getting manipulated, you know? Just just calm down a bit. Wait a couple more weeks to see what else they have to offer and everything. And then we're going to go from there. Because college football, they already got my money. They had my money the second reveal. So, hey.